Hello and welcome to another video brought to you by the good people at FM Wonder Kids. Today we're looking at the top five players you can sign in the left back position for under five million pounds. Now do us a favor if you like our videos, smash a like on the video. Head on over to Patreon if you want to download all our shortlists and subscribe if you are new. If you want to download our shortlists, it works like this. Very, very simple. Head on over to Patreon. Download a shortlist, click the load shortlist button, and then this boom is what you are eligible to use. All these lists, best free transfers, free transfers mark two, three, four, and five, bargain goalkeepers, best goalkeepers, huge current ability list, top 10 youngsters by ability, top 60 release clauses, top five release clauses, best young left backs under five million pound. Click load, bang, there it is ready for you to go. Now, first up, we're gonna go for this guy, Marcos Lopez. In the future here, he's 28 years old and he's developed rather nicely. Dribbling, crossing and corners, acceleration and pace. Oh my God, I would be buying this guy for sure. He's under five million pounds. He's got technique, passing, long throws, first touch dribbling, crossing. He's probably lacking on the mental side, which you normally would see from your fullbacks, but he makes up for that purely over here on the technical side of things. Under five minutes, start of the game, let's have a look at his history. What's happened? There it is, history. Playing in Peru, so depending on where you're playing your football, it might have, you might get have work permit issues, but he goes to the USA here for 300,000, and then to Everton for 6 million and 20. 21. Interesting. Next up, Josef Brian Bakai, the Norwegian left back. You can see here in the future he's developed some decent concentration as well as composure, and crucially, his physical side of his game is quite good. Acceleration, pace, and stamina, all above 14. Technically, again, with these fullbacks, you're not going to see Messi playing at fullback, but you are going to see a little smidgen of mentality and physicality, which certainly this guy has for under five million pounds. Let's have a look, a look at his history. So you could develop him a little bit better, better excuse me, by giving him a bit more games. Um, but he goes to West Brom here for 775 in 2019 and plays for them for the rest of this save. Next up, Tony Hierro Herrero. Herrera Roche, very well rounded. That's more of the kind of left back you're looking at seeing. Um, yeah, pretty decent. Nothing really stands out, but he's got agility 14, pace 14, very well rounded. I keep saying that, but he's determined. He's got anticipation, which is great for fullbacks. You anticipate the dribble or the cross, whatever. Technique again, quite good technically, but. He's got everything you would want without being outstanding in any of the areas. So have a little look at his history. Levante's played for the same team for the whole game here. Again, so you could develop him a little bit more because he didn't play any games in this season or this season. He played one game in this season. So if you played him in more games, he would obviously develop better. Next up, Vazquez. Wing back left, this guy is described as my, from my scout. Acceleration and agility and stamina, great. But now you're talking my language in terms of fullbacks. Attacking fullback is his media description, runs the ball down the left, gets forward whenever possible. Um, mentally, you're not actually that great mentally. He's got a couple of 13s obviously here. Concentration, decision, and determination, which is good. And his tackling is 13, which is at the very least I would expect really. Um, so he looks like he's gonna put a shift in for you, definitely. On that, um, on that, la in that left back position, but for me, he'd probably just be a backup. Next up, then Melvin Bard. This guy is a French left back or lived back, as they say in France. Uh, acceleration, natural fitness, pace. Again, nothing really stands out, but for under five million, you'd be you'd be happy with this, I guess. Determination. Uh, Nice couple of 14s there mentally, aggression, anticipation, and bravery. Um, the crossing and dribbling isn't um, bad as well as the first touch, but you can see he's good at marking, which is very, very good. 
and tackling as well. Runs more ball down the left. Let's have a little look at Melvin Bard's history. Again, playing for Leon's second team and then Nancy. So again, if you played him in a bit more games, he would develop a little bit better for you. A little bit of an underwhelming finish there, but never mind. Next up, centre-backs. Join us every Monday at 3 o'clock. I think it's 3 o'clock for these Wonder Kids videos. Wednesdays are Wolverhampton Wonder Kids Save, a season review every single week. Friday is Man United Career Mode. Thank you very much for watching. Head on over to Patreon if you want to download our shortlists. Subscribe if you are new. See you next time.